Hey guys, Brad with Ice Camp Outfitters. Well, me and Wayne, the owner of Garrison Sports, we're out checking ice today, and we didn't get too far offshore in front of Garrison Sports and ran at like two and a half, three. Mind you, three, four days ago, this ice was complete garbage. I mean, it was waterlogged, it was whatever. But I ended up driving around the lake again today and pretty much found the same thing as the last report. But the good news is, I actually found more ice down in the South Bays and over there by Kevin, the boathouse area, like they're still on foot traffic. And I know guys are catching fish down there. So if you're looking to get out, get a hold of those guys. Um, the other good news, we had the spotting scopes out and the binoculars. And granted, there is open water behind me here, but it looks like beyond there, as far as we can tell with the glass, is that that's froze over. So what we have now is less open water than we had a day ago, which is really good. And I'm thinking like tonight, we might get a full glaze over across the lake. What's really hurting us right now is last night it blew 20, 25 miles an hour all night, stirred up, brought that warm water up so it wasn't able to cap. So we're hoping tonight the winds are gonna drop down, seal everything up. But if you guys are looking to get out on the ice, be sure to check out the resorts on the South Bays or give you know that east side, Kevin McCoy, give them a buzz because I know they're letting people out. So anyways, we'll have another update for you guys next week. Or actually, now we'll probably go out Thursday this week and give you another update. So if you need any bait, be sure to support the local businesses and we'll catch you guys soon.